Amanda Hughes here, one of the researchers for Family Tree Nuts, and I'm in Beaufort National Cemetery, toward the back of the cemetery, at a memorial dedicated to the 54th and the 55th Massachusetts. As you may be aware, especially if you've seen the movie Glory, the 54th and 55th Massachusetts regiments were regiments of African descent, United States colored troops, in the Union during the Civil War. The 54th was commanded by Robert Gould Shaw, who was the son of an abolitionist family from Massachusetts. The 54th and 55th Massachusetts came here to Beaufort. They were stationed at Camp Saxton, which is located on the present day Naval Hospital compound. They participated in different battles and skirmishes along the Georgia coast and even into Florida. But it is a battle in July of 1863, after Gettysburg, the Battle of Fort Wagner that we are going to focus on today. Again, if you've seen the movie Glory, you understand what led up to the assault on Battery Wagner. And the honor of the lead position went to the 54th Massachusetts. When Colonel Shaw signaled the advance, they came under heavy Confederate fire. And pushing forward, they took many heavy losses. Shaw led his men through the moat and up the wall. And once they reached the top, he urged his men on, forward 54th, forward 54th. And when he turned, he was shot multiple times in the chest and killed. Ultimately, the battle was a defeat for the Union forces. And after the battle, most of the men were buried in a mass grave on the beachhead. However, usually the officers were returned to the opposing force. And that is what happened here. Most of the officers of the Union forces were returned by those Confederates that were inside the battery. However, the body of Colonel Shaw was not. The Confederate commander thought he was doing Colonel Shaw a disrespect, a disservice, by adding his body to those of his men in the mass grave. However, Colonel Shaw's father said that his son could have been bestowed no greater honor. There are actually many soldiers of the 54th Massachusetts here in Beaufort National Cemetery in known graves. Section 16 here is one of the largest burial sites for soldiers of the regiment. That's because they ended up dying here in the Union hospitals, either of their wombs or of disease. In 1987, 120 years after the end of the Civil War, some souvenir hunters who were searching for relics along the beachhead near Fort Wagner found human remains. Through archaeology and other forensic testing, those remains were found to be 19 bodies from the 54th and 55th Massachusetts. It is presumed that Colonel Robert Shaw was among those who were found in 1987. On Memorial Day of 1989, those 19 bodies were reinterred here in a mass grave dedicated by the memorial stones behind me. Thank you for watching, and please remember, family tree nuts. Let our nuts find the nuts in your family tree. Like what you see? Make sure you follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to click the little bell so you get notifications as to when we post new videos. And you can find out more about us and contact us at familytreenuts.org.